Paid for Team Kate during her battle with cancer. News 11's Crystal Jimenez sat down with Kate's mom. She joins us in studio with that story tonight. Kate's mother has made it clear while Kate is no longer physically here with us, there is still work to be done for childhood cancer, but she needs the community's help. <sighs> is um, that I have cancer. I know, crazy. This vivacious, caring, and beloved teen taken by cancer just last week. Kate Campa never wanted her cancer to define her. Every single person says, your daughter was always smiling, always doing the thumbs up. Yeah, for a picture, but they were not with her 24-7. They didn't see what cancer had done to her body. Kate tried to live life like any other child between treatments. Where is your happy place? Dance. I'm going to miss watching her on stage. I'm going to miss watching her dance. Um, dance was a big part of her life. Because she had to seek treatment in another city, it was difficult. She wanted better treatment. She wanted more options. She wanted to do some of the stuff that they were doing in Phoenix here in Yuma. While Kate isn't physically here anymore, her parents don't want her memory to be in vain. The fight for childhood cancer is important now more than ever for Kate's family. Now it's time for us to really sit down and say, what is it going to take for that door to not just be cracked open, but to be open. The cards didn't play the way we wanted them to to go, um, but I, I know that she, what I'm doing now uh, is what she would want me to do. Hi, Mom and Dad. I just wanted to say thank you for everything that you've done. I love you so, so, so much, and I hope you enjoy this game. Educate others. Talk about Kate. Talk about her story. Or maybe don't talk about Kate. There's other kids in our community um, that have passed before Kate that are as important as Kate. Talk about them. Advocating for childhood cancer, more funding, and more options is how we can all help Kate and the other children we have lost to cancer already. Reporting in Yuma, Crystal Jimenez, News 11. Crystal, thanks. And with that, we'll switch to a look outside. Good evening to you, Rob. Oh, good evening to you, Jenny, and everyone else at home as well. Let's take a look at what we're seeing in regards to your RV World Yuma.